here comes Santa Claus, here comes Santa Claus, right down Santa Claus Lane. What's up, everybody? Good hey. afternoon. How you guys doing today? Today is a new day. I don't know if this video is going to be a part of the last clip that we did or if this is just an entirely new video, but it doesn't really matter because we're pretty much in a good mood and we're getting ready for Christmas. Yes. So in this video, we're going to be trying to prepare our Christmas tree for decoration but before we do that i wanted to kind of do a little bit of diy a little bit of testing out something uh adrian if you are watching this video you are my inspiration for trying this because generally every year when we get ready to put up our christmas tree i generally spray our christmas tree with this snow stuff right here and just kind of make it white because it's just cheaper and it still looks good and you get the same kind of idea. But because of her, she had made me want to learn how to flock my own tree. And most of the items to flock your tree on the budget, I have. So uh, I'm just trying to see if I can make it work. Uh, some of the key things I don't have, but I'm thinking I can still get the same idea. If you don't know what flocking is, flocking is pretty much trees or it looks like something is freshly snowed on. That is the goal. I don't know if I'm gonna do this right, but I'm pulling David along and he's gonna be my helping man and we're just gonna do it. So. I had made a concoction over here. One lady I had used some starch. So this is starch and some uh, spray can of shaving cream. This stinks by the way, really bad. And I had made a concoction of white makeup, paint, water, and Mod Podge. So I don't know if this is even gonna work, but I'm gonna just use a combination of this, the starch, in the snow to see if we can get that flocking look so i don't know if this gonna work disclaimer but if it's a fail oh well life move on wash the tree off let's get to it i'm so mad we've been getting prepared for this and it started raining i really wanted to do this in the backyard but it's clearly not gonna work because it is so gray outside it's not even funny so we had Put out an old sheet. Actually, this don't look like an old sheet. We can get a new one. Mm -hmm. Anyway, so yeah, we just put out a sheet in the garage and then we're gonna go ahead and start off with the base first. Let's see how this turns out. Hope this works, child. Guess let's try the paint concoction first because I don't know. Okay. okay. I'm just trying to check and see if it got enough paint to shine. A little like your white. Yeah. Is the water your white? Is this enough water? Is this enough paint? Hmm. Let me try. You want to try to spray some snow on it? Stay scared. Just, yeah. <laughs> it's all right, go ahead. Don't try to cover it all, let make it look sporadic. Child, I don't know. Let's see. I'm just gonna, let's see if the it's not gonna stick. Oh, it kind of looked like it looked went to be smashed on there. Yeah, to carry this into the house. Huh? Yeah, to carry it into the house. I hope it stays. Yeah, I use glue and hairspray. It has to dry. Some parts of it look like it. I mean, I thought this was gonna be creamier. See, it's not creamy at all. So I'm gonna try to put some latex, uh, liquid latex in here, like for Halloween. Like I said, I don't know if this gonna work, child, but we will need a mess. Liquid latex. Uh, I don't got no glue. Now, if I had glue, this would be straight, but I don't got no glue, so. I 
I know this dries, but it's just I'll put some gloves on here. Oh, it's already drying on my hand. Oh, this might be too dry. It won't even come off my hands. Look at that. Look at this. It won't even come off my hands. Fail. So let's figure out something else. Trial and error number two. Mosh posh. Pretty much at the end, whatever's on here, I'm gonna put a uh, hairspray on it to see and let it dry for 24 hours. Now, I'm just being really cheap, but if I had almost glue, this would go a lot faster. This is why it could be a fail. I'm just gonna spray with some hold spray. Show them what it looks like. Yeah, just regular like holding spray. So I'm just put it on there just so when it dries, it may look even better. So this is what it's looking like so far. And to me, honestly, it don't look too bad. What do you think? It looks good. Look at my hands. Look at his hands. Does it look kind of snowed on? Like it could be even better, but I don't think it's that bad. Nah, it looks good. I kind of just feel like we should just do the whole tree all at once. You think so? Because we do particles just to make sure. Yeah, but we got to do the rest of it. Yeah, we're just going to throw the other ones on top. You can put, when we put that second piece on top, you see the difference between what it used to look like and what it looks like now. Yeah. Now later on, I may throw some glue on this, but right now it's just decent enough. Uh, this is the crumbs. This is what it looked like up close. This is a good close up of what that looks like so let's go ahead and put this one or the second piece on top but we got this tree on sale for like eighty dollars i think it was maybe less than that maybe yeah this still have residue from last year but you can see the difference of this to that all right round two I wonder if you spray some snow like hard on the end if it will like to a lot. Yeah. That kind of looks good. Shit, that. I know. That's what I was like, bro. You have some that. I know. I don't need me doing all this. All I got to do is do the spray. Why do I do this, man? Show the close up. Bruh, y'all should have seen this. You've been doing this wrong the whole time. Wrong. Look. Look at that, hold on. Flopped. Flopped, y'all. Why are we doing all this work? <sighs> Cut. Cut. It's done, it's done. Cut. We don't get done. This is it. That's all we need right here. Yeah. Just probably that and use the spray paint, to, uh, not spray paint, but the hairspray to make sure it stay. Bruh. We've been doing this wrong the whole time. The whole time. Hold on. That's why you gotta read directions. No, because it said you can't use that to flop on there. Well, let's spray light first and then heavy on the end when we're almost done. Okay. Now I said flops and then heavy at the end. You want to spray the hairspray while I'm doing this? Just like that. Not that much, obviously, but you get my drift. You like it better? 
All right, time to do the top. <laughs> Look at it. <laughs> Keep whipping it. Pipe it up. Pipe it up. Bring it up. Bring it up. Yeah, girl. So what I had heard of today. <laughs> Uh, what 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 you heard? I heard they ain't shit. <laughs> oh yeah. Mhm. Mm <laughs> you flocking that tree, uh, girl? Who else you had doing your hair? <laughs> they did not do a good job. <laughs> uh, I'm all out. See, your head too big. <laughs> all right. All right. So this is what the tree looking like. So, I think we have done enough. The goal is for it to look like this tomorrow. So I'm wondering if I wanna leave it out here overnight. Yeah. Probably so. All right, so this is gonna be the end of our little DIY, little flocking situation. I did go ahead and throw some more paint and a little bit more starch on there to see if some of it would grasp because of the hair, um, what you call that, hair spray? spray. Yeah, spray glue. Yeah, so I did pour some more starch on there and some paint and try to see if they dry together. I know some of it's gonna fall, but I'm wondering if it cured for a while that it would sit there. But this is the finished look, you guys. I think it turned out really well, especially since our tree is very thin. Yeah, it makes it look a little thicker. Yeah, so it makes it look a lot thicker. And I did put the snow on it last year, but nowhere near as much. Fingers across. Do not know if this is a fail or a go, but if you did this in the house or your house is big enough, you have like not carpet on your floors, I would say try it, put it together, and finish it off in the house. As long as you get the look and it stay there, about Christmas time, who cares? You know, you're just gonna put decoration over anyway. So that is the little project and That's step one. Step one and our Christmas is starting. And I'm so excited so we can start getting into the holiday spirit. Okay. Mm -hmm. But yeah, I think that's gonna be it. This is not gonna be a long video, but we just want to show you guys our trial and error and our tree. <laughs> so excited. So until next time. See you guys later. See ya. Bye. So it is the next day. This is the finished look. I think it looks pretty good. Kind of missed a spot right here. So I probably would have put some more right there. Overall, I'm pretty happy with it. It's more water than it was the year before. But yeah, my advice I would say is do this if you pretty much just want a white tree and you want it to look a little bit fuller. Generally when I do do this, cause even when I just sprayed it lightly just to get it kind of white, uh, there wasn't really much of stuff dropping on my floors, but just a little bit when I first started to put the decorations on. So I personally don't care because I can like vacuum up and it's just me and my husband. So we're not gonna really touch it again, but if you have kids or something that always mess with the tree, I would just spray it white and just overly spray some areas with the whole little snow bottle thing, but I definitely wouldn't do the Mod Podge thing or the cornstarch without having the glue. Like I said, I probably said it a thousand times in this video, but this didn't work as well with the cornstarch because I did not have glue. If I had glue, this wouldn't be a problem, but because I didn't, it does. So I just kind of um, sprayed the 
snow a little bit heavier. This is not meant to flock, but if you want to flock look, then you don't really mess with your tree once it's decorated. I would highly suggest doing this because I, I do it every year now. I spray my tree white. I never did this much, but we're just going to shake it and then I will probably end up showing you a picture of what it end up looking like. But we're going to do another video of us actually decorating the tree so you get to see how it looks in the end. But I want to come back in and show you guys what it's looking like. I'm pretty proud of it. I'm a person who loves to fake it till I make it. And to me, this is fake flopped. <laughs> so, yeah. Thank you guys for watching, and I will see you in the next one. Bye.